Hey guys, so welcome back to Mitchell's Mining 2. So today we are doing some testing at the same spot we were yesterday with the turbo pan. So what we what we've done here is we found a lot of garnets. And we're gonna see if there's any gold in there. So I'm also up with the garnets and the gold, so I'll show you the equipment we brought. We brought the half inch classifier here at Super Sluice. Oh, yeah, fine. Oh, right there. Prospector scoop. We're feeding the sluice. And yes, we brought a sluice box. Little old sluice box. We brought we brought her down there here today because we got good views on our sluice box river test. Like almost up to 30 now. So we just set a rock here. That way we got enough water flow. And I figured out the water flow we need. It needs to be halfway up the sluice here. And then it'll just, it'll get higher since the riffles will push it up. And a uh, quarter inch arbor fabricating classifier. We brought that today. And the eighth inch. We brought both of them today because yesterday the eighth inch, I was just throwing out all the big rocks. I was hoping to find some big garnets. So, if we do, it'll get caught below this, and we won't have very many rocks below it. So, yeah, um, I brought our shovel. Brought a granola bar. <laughs> In case if I get hungry. And then, we brought this. This is a holder that will clip onto me, that way I can use both hands. I'm doing everything such as classifying and putting dirt into the sluice. So I already took a test pan right here. So they may be running here. And we'll see. Water goes bucket. So let's get to classifying. Gotta put my thing in the holder real quick. There we go. Nice and snug. Find a nice place to hook it. <laughs> I'm sorry, I got in front of the camera. This is hard trying to clip it onto me somewhere where it's not going to be a problem so take off our coat because it's warm throw it up there there we go so we'll start a digging My phone doesn't fall. <laughs> Problem with this, there's so many rocks here. There's also a lot of black sands. <sighs> there we go. That should be enough. Uh, 
plane. I'm right there in the rapids. I don't see anything in that one. There we go. Oops, sorry. So we're gonna keep classifying and then once we got a bucket, it'll show us feeding it into the sluice box right there. Right by the bridge. Okay, so we got it all classified down. That took a long time due to the problem that the material is hard to dig and there wasn't much dirt in it. It was a lot of rock, but here's what we got here. Didn't find any big garnets, that's a shame, but still. Maybe we can find something better. Slap that right down in there. Got the rock over it, that way it doesn't float away. Let's slowly run to it over the sluice. There you go. It's a nice little place. You see all the material moving around in there? Just pour some material over the ripples, little by little. That way the big rock, I don't want to escape the classifier. Let the ripples clear out before you pour any more dirt in it. It's going to be cleaning out okay. Lots of black sand building off right around the sluice box. That's kind of weird though. You see black sand just building up around the letters. That's a sluice box right there. It's kind of cool. Another big rock. Jeez. Bucket yet. We didn't go very long without filming. <laughs> Hasn't been a very long video for how long I've been here. Oh, that was a big rock there. Oh, fell apart because it's wet. It made too much dirt go through. My 
my brother drove by. <laughs> This little thing can handle it. <laughs> Probably wouldn't make a bad high banker, to be honest. You just have a little, maybe concentrated high banker. Some of these rocks must have, I must have not gotten them in the classifier right. But, I don't, this so this seems to be working really good. So guys, that may be all for this video. I'm not sure yet. And, uh, yep. <laughs> okay, so, Please like, comment, comment if you like the sluice box. You can buy one of these off from Amazon, Walmart. Well, I think they have them at. I don't think you can buy them in the Walmart store, but if you look online, you might find one. And uh, if you have any video, if you have any video ideas, just put them in the comments below. I look, I look at all the comments, even though I haven't gotten one yet, but I will look at all of them as soon as I can. So, yeah, so I'll see you next time.